Greetings, my name is Lucy Hayes. Is it not a lovely day? Did you know that I love gardens and plants? That is why I built the conservatory in the executive mansion. Here, I'll tell you all about my life. My birthday was August 28, 1831. I was born to Dr. James Webb and Maria Webb. I was the youngest and the only girl in our family of three children. My father died just a month before I was two. My mother did her best to take care of my two older brothers and I. We went, I went to a girls' school at the age of six in my hometown of Chillicothe, Ohio. I was educated there for seven years until I went to another school for three more years. After those 10 years and a good education, I went on to a girls' college. College was definitely new for women then. In fact, I was the first first lady to graduate from college. I graduated in June 1850, and I was not even 20 years old. Despite being well-educated, the only jobs for women were accepting roles as wives and mothers. I took on one of these jobs joyfully on December 30, 1852, when I married Rutherford B. Hayes. In fact, both of our mothers went to the same church and were both widows, and they both agreed that we would be a good match for one another before I even met him. I took on the, the other job as a mother in 1853 when I gave birth to my first child of eight children. Oh, how they made my life a blessing. When I was first lady, I refused to serve liquor in the White House. Instead, I served lemonade. I was then given the nickname of Lemonade Lucy. I am a very religious woman, and I believe that alcohol and drugs should never be permitted. Even though I did speak my mind about my beliefs, I declined any leadership or spokesperson's role. I did enjoy our White House events, especially when the children were involved. However, I was quite upset that the Easter egg roll at the Capitol was banned. Therefore, I started the tradition of the White House Easter egg roll in 1878. Also, since Rutherford was president after the Civil War, I had to make sure, as a hostess, that I brought all of America together by having American-themed parties I even had him singing events with friends and family as a pastime in the executive mansion. There is nothing like spending time with my husband and my children and enjoying nature. I love animals, especially birds, and I can even do quite a few bird calls. It's been quieter since I was first lady, but I like that. I enjoyed being in the public eye, but now I just go to church and joyfully live my life. I've been very blessed.